Wow, we're not even drunk yet. Thanks guys. How we going? I don't understand why people have 8 a.m. meeting. Forgot that I had a meeting this early and I was like not awake through the entire thing. Uh, I'm just gonna get through this day. So I am getting a lot done today. I honestly was so tired this morning that I drank two cups of coffee, which I usually never do. And I'm like shaking right now. I literally feel like a crazy person, but I'm getting so much done. So I feel really, really good. Um, so right now I'm working on some email campaigns that we're sending out and I just have to make some final edits right now on the emails. And it takes quite a while just because they're so, just so complex building emails. Um, there's so many little things that you have to like double check and stuff like that. So I have two of them, two campaigns that I need to make edits on. I just finished one. I have one more left to do. It took me like an hour and a half to do edits, maybe like an hour to do edits on the first. And then my manager just pinged me and she wants me to do something for her. So I'm basically gathering results from all of, all of the marketing campaigns on my team. So like not just mine, but like all of the team's marketing campaigns. So I'm sending a note to the team right now just to make sure everyone's stuff is in before we go on break for holiday. Um, just so my boss can have it. Yeah, so once that's done, I'm going to finish up my other email campaign that I need to make edits for. <sighs> I think I can do this. So yeah, one more to go. Feeling good. I will talk to you guys soon. Just finished feel really good. Um, that one took a little bit longer just because I had more changes I had to make, but I'm getting really hungry right now. So I'm going to go ahead and make some lunch. Okay. So I'm not vegan or even vegetarian, but I mainly eat vegetarian food at home. So I'm going to make these dumplings. They have tofu and veggies in them. I never had it before. So I'm really excited to try it. I'll let you guys know how I like it. One thing that I'm learning about like working with people is that even with adults, like think about when you have a group project, you know how like you get annoyed sometimes when you have a group project because it's like, okay, you can have very clear instructions and like everyone interprets things very, very differently. I just know for me, like when I was in school, I hated working with groups. Like I just preferred doing things on my own. The more people that are involved in a group, the more complicated a project becomes. If I just do it myself, it's usually very, very easy. So right now, like when I sent out this email asking everyone to provide their updates for their campaigns, it's like such a big team we have a huge team now it's just like oh my gosh it's such simple instructions that i feel like i gave everyone and also it's like when you work with people your age in college like on group projects and stuff everyone gets it everyone is like okay look we're doing this for a grade whatever whatever whereas when you're working in real life most people that i work with are in their 30s or 40s um and some in their 50s right and so it's just a totally different dynamic and some people take this job like so seriously like it's life or death and some people are like me and it's just like okay i'm gonna work hard but it's just a job, like, you know, like, I don't know, it's just so funny. I just had a veggie burger and it was so good, but I just ate it so fast. I feel like sick, but Anyways, I just signed up for masterclass. I actually got a free like year trial um, from my job and I'm super excited about it because I've always wanted to check it out, but obviously I didn't want to pay for it. So this was super, super perfect. Like this is a great gift for my company. Um, and obviously the holidays are coming up. So I'm going to have two weeks of PTO. So I'm definitely going to be spending as much time as I can um, taking some master classes. It's almost 6 p.m. actually right now. And I've actually been babysitting Deku's mom. They definitely like have their moments where they don't get along, but it's been really, really fun. So I'm actually about to meet my friend who owns Deku's mom here in a little bit for some drinks. So until then, I need to kind of straighten up my place a little bit. So I think I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna get ready to go out for drinks.
Still got love for your mommy. I know you wanna be somebody, even if you gotta leave somebody. Yes, I'm hurting, yes, I'm dead. Most of the things I don't wanna say. I won't be around while you chase. Okay, excuse how messy my bathroom is, but yeah, this is the look you guys can see. And then I'm doing the gold, and then I have this little black bag and my watch and all that stuff. So yeah, we're about to head out. Um, I'm taking the dogs with me because we're going to a place that allows dogs. We're going to like a rooftop bar thing. But yeah, I'm probably gonna have like one drink because I'm so fucking tired. And then I'll probably come back and go to sleep early today. What's good, YouTube? I'm on my way right now to go take some pictures for Instagram. So I usually take my pictures on top of my apartment um, roof, but I kind of want to change up like the scenery today. So I don't want like my pictures to look all the same. Um, and I've gotten more comfortable with taking my own pictures now because my boyfriend used to take them for me and now I'm kind of doing them more on my own. So I'm on my way right now to the Domain, which is a really big shopping center here in Austin. And I'm just gonna try to find a spot for my picture. Tonight, I'm going to some Christmas bars with my friends. My friend Veronica mapped out an entire, basically like a bar crawl for us to do some Christmas bar hopping. And I've never been to a Christmas bar before, so I'm really, really excited. Apparently, Austin has some really cool ones. Okay, so I found a spot. It's not too public. It's like this little shopping center right here. Um, and this little corner restaurant right here is closed. I thought the browns would be like nice with my outfit because it's like cream, you know? But um, there's like a major road that like everyone can kind of see. But I feel like it's not that bad. I'm kind of nervous, but whatever. I'm just gonna do it. So I have my tripod set up. I'm just gonna try to take as many pictures as I, as I can. And if I don't like the way these look, then I'm honestly just gonna go back to my apartment roof because that's just like what I'm used to. So. Yeah, let's go ahead and try. Okay, so I got the pictures. I only had one car honk at me, which was nice. I was a lot less nervous than I thought I would be. Like, honestly, just I just don't pay any mind to like what's going on around me. I'm really just focused on taking the pictures. I'm gonna go home and look at the pictures and edit them really quickly. Let's go edit. <laughs> hey guys, actually I've been spending the rest of my day working on my video that I'm uploading tomorrow. I'm very, very excited about this video and by now you guys would have seen it, but um, it's been taking me so long to edit it just because I'm going through like basically my entire life and including so many pictures and videos and memories um, to really like set the scene for the story that I'm telling. It's definitely going to be worth it in the end. I'm really, really excited about it. Um, it's just like, oh my god, I've never spent this many hours on a video before. But that being said, tonight's going to be a lot of fun. We are actually going to be going to some Christmas bars. Um, around Austin and I thought I would take you guys with us because it's gonna be crazy We haven't been out like in a long time and all the girls are dressed up wearing some onesies tonight And I'm not because I don't have one, but I'm still dressed like Christmas Eve, right? So I can show you guys what I'm wearing when I'm done getting ready. Um, let me just find my lip liner. I can't find it. Fuck <laughs> Wow We're not even drunk yet So I uploaded my video today. I uploaded it about three hours ago and I was so nervous. Like I literally had like a knot in my stomach when I was putting it up because it's just so like vulnerable and like just so different than like anything else I've ever made. Usually all my videos are very much about like money and like simple productivity stuff, like very surface level stuff. So for me to get like really deep on my channel was very different for me. I'm proud of myself for uploading it and I also feel like people are liking it, which is really cool. I'm getting some good feedback and like just like really nice, sweet, really positive comments um, from you guys and I just been really appreciating seeing that. I do feel kind of sick from last night, like just a little bit, but luckily I wasn't that drunk somehow, even though I feel like we had a lot of drinks and I feel like I feel 
sick, but not from drinking too much, but because we mixed so many kinds of drinks. It was a really fun night though. Today's gonna be a really chill day, you guys. I'm just gonna be cleaning around the house. Colin's on his way over right now, so we're probably gonna hang out. So I'm making chili right now, you guys. Um, I'm obviously making it vegetarian, because you guys know I don't really eat meat like that. Um, and I'm gonna force him to eat it too, but he went and got himself a hot dog to put the chili on So it's gonna be no longer vegetarian for him. I never made chili before so I'm kind of nervous But I think it'll turn out good Try it. it actually is really good <laughs> yeah, I'm not even gonna lie with you, yeah. but you should put tahini on the rim you know what I'm about? How do you like do it on the rim? What do you do? Just do water and put it on it? Let me teach you let me teach you a little something, something. I'm gonna try to claim credit for my drink. I have to put some salt on the rim, huh? I want one too now. I was really hungover. I was like, I'm not gonna drink today. Now here we are. Can you pull your recipe? Sure, it's two frozen strawberries, a little bit of like frozen mango chunks, um, ice. I don't white know wine. Which white wine I use, but yeah, white wine. Splash of white wine. Chardonnay. And um, yeah, and then tahine. tahine and brown sugar. Did you put in lemon juice too? Lemon juice, yeah. Mmm, it's really good. It tastes like a margarita, but like more sophisticated. Does that make sense? Very good job. Did something about you that's so familiar. Something that's got me wanting to know you. And I can't put my finger on it, but it feels all I could be here before. So good. Oh my gosh, I love it. That makes me wonder. I swear I met you 